guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm out with Anthony. Hey. Uh, we're at the shore today. Um, this is a spot I haven't been to in years. Uh, when was the last time you were here? Yeah, it's been a few years. It's been a couple years for him too. So we decided where it's been hot and muggy and just horrible heat, we decided to come out to the shore today mm -hmm. to be a little cooler. So for, yeah, we, yeah, for our tent setups and all that stuff, we got just basic stuff. You know, he's got a, the One Tiger's Tan Graham Backpacker's Tent. Uh, myself, well, I got a Pomali tent, so I have the, what's it called, uh, the Hot, Hot Fort Shelter, Hot Shelter, something like that. It is a hot tent, but I'm not using the stove in it today, so. Uh, we're going to pick our spots where we're going to set up and we'll bring you guys back as we're, go as we're going. Alright everybody, uh, we got our tents all set up. I had to relocate mine. I had to, from where I was, I put it over here. Basically it's in front of the fire pit. Kinda. Um, I do have my tent set up in porch mode right now. Uh, just, just because I guess. Uh, ease of access and everything. So, uh, Anthony's over boiling us up some water for coffee because we haven't had a coffee for, for a little while. So we decided to Sit here, have a coffee, chit chat a little bit. Uh, get, you know, a nice view of the shoreline. The tide is going out, so maybe a little bit later on, we'll uh, take a walk down on the beach. He says there's a waterfall down here, so we're gonna go find it. So, 
Uh, oh, excuse me. That would be really cool. Um, what else? We are going to gather up a little bit of firewood. Not There's already some here, but not enough for, for all night. Uh, we won't be having that till a little, a little bit later on anyways. Um, but there is firewood up the trail a little bit. <clears throat> Sorry. And there is some down around here. We're going to search down on the beach for a little bit of driftwood. Uh, down off that way, around the corner, uh, there might be some, you know, fair sized pieces, some smaller pieces. We don't know. We haven't been down there yet. But um, there is a freshwater stream running just behind the camera. I don't think the camera is picking it up, but there is one there. There's a little tiny waterfall just over here to the right down the trail. I'll show you guys that here after a little bit. But uh, right now I think the water is almost ready for coffee. So I think we're going to make one each and enjoy the heck out of it and enjoy the nice beautiful scenery behind us. <laughs> Right, guys coffee's good I share but it's my coffee you guys can have some later <laughs> but notice they were sitting here enjoying our coffee I'm not sure how much he has left in his or a little bit a little bit left in yours oh, yeah. so yeah, so we're gonna finish our coffees head down on the beach the tide is going out mm -hmm. so we're hoping for for a nice little sunset tonight it is cloudy uh, we have our both we both have our tents set up so that we're facing the water uh, If I wanted to I could open my other side up on on my tent and uh, I could have a clear shot of the outside um, I think we might take Anthony's tent and Do the awning style on on his as well that way you can you know kind of sit there later on tonight or whatever or first thing in the morning kind of look off and look off into the water and See a nice little sunrise and all that fun stuff, but man, this coffee's good. But <clears throat> no, we uh, gotta go look for firewood here after a bit anyway. So gonna bump around a little bit, relax for I don't know five or ten more minutes, and go find that waterfall. What do you think? Oh, yeah. Just down there. Just down there, is it? Yeah, all right. Different. Apparently, it's not very far away, but we're gonna go to it anyways. It's gonna be awesome. Probably not like what it would be in the springtime though. Oh, springtime would be just phenomenal. Yeah. All that snow melt. Yeah. Oh, buddy. Yeah. All right, we'll bring you guys back in a little bit. Fancy. I don't want to sleep in here, you know? Fresh water dripping. Can't get back far enough. I can probably sleep in there and not get wet if it rains. Be kind of warm. You know, well, there's a little bit of driftwood across here. Enough to make a small fire for maybe a couple hours. That'd be about it. Well, there's firewood inside here, but uh, I think this might just give me give me an idea here. We'll see what the future holds. 
See if I can get back here. Hello. Onto the waterfall. fresh water if we had to. Uh, yeah. Can you imagine this thing in the springtime? Yeah. Just crushing right out, running right down to the open ocean. Now that would look cool. Even in the wintertime, coming down here, just here flowing down, icicles all over the place, water flowing underneath it. Now that would be a nice picture. But today, I'll settle for this.
Alright guys, we, uh, well, I got my supper. Anthony's already ate. His supper was a little faster than mine. So he got to eat his sooner than I did. So we got water heat, uh, we got water heated up for coffee. That's just sitting right in front of me, cooling down for a second or two. Uh, I got supper going right here. I have seafood ramen noodles mixed with hamburger, or sorry, with ground beef, with a couple strips of, uh, bacon that Anthony brought. So, what kind of bacon was that? What is that? Pepper. Pepper. The pepper, pepper peppercorn? Mm -hmm. Peppercorn bacon. Right. He brought like a pound and a half, or was it a pound and a half or something? Or? One, one kg. 1.1 kg. All right. Yeah, 2.2 So, it's a fair sized package. <laughs> so, if everything goes well, we might end up having bacon for breakfast. Probably, yeah. So, but right now it's starting to sprinkle with rain. So, yeah. if it starts raining too hard, I'm going to retreat to my tent and eat in there. Uh, well, Anthony could sit in there too and kind of chit chat away like we usually do. Uh, yeah, I don't coffee. think it's going to too much though. So, yeah. but don't. No. Yeah, it's starting to come down a little bit, but not too bad right now. So, yeah, anyways, I'm going to eat, make a coffee. I'll bring you guys back later. Okay guys, uh, it's hitting about 9.30ish right now. Uh, we're just going to kick back and go into relax mode for the rest of the evening. The campfire's coming along nicely. Uh, it kind of died out on us as we were eating supper and everything like that. So we're just kind of getting it going. The mosquitoes and black flies are starting to come around, but not that bad. Uh, smoke's probably keeping, keeping them away for the most part, but... I say we'll uh, put up with it for a little bit, but here very shortly, I'm going to get my sleep system set up and probably head to bed uh, one or two or three hours maybe. So we're just going to kick back around the campfire, chit chat like normal, enjoy you know enjoy the sounds of the ocean and the waves and the odd foghorn every now and again. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. And, until uh, morning, we'll catch you guys later. Morning everybody. We, uh, we're a little soggy right now. <laughs> decided to open up on us while we were eating breakfast and drinking our coffee and whatnot. We had a small fire going up to cook a little, a little bit of bacon. It was starting to rain then, so I just I didn't want to get my camera wet, phone, microphone, all that stuff wet. So we just did our thing, got going, ate it. As we were eating, it started opening up, so we moved in. And underneath my tent, it's got the awning on it. I still got water dripping off my hat. But, uh, gonna bump around here a little bit, slowly pack up and enjoy coffee. I don't know if you're having another coffee or not. Alright, yeah. Nancy's gonna have another coffee here, so. Just gonna bump around, clean up camp a little bit, get our stuff packed up, and head her for home, so. We'll, uh, we'll bring you guys back part way through and let you know how things are going.
All right, guys. I'm all packed up. Anthony's already headed back to the car. I just had a couple last minute things to do. I roll up my tent. My tent is soaked, so that's not going in my backpack. I'm just going to carry it up to the car. The car is about 7,800 feet back that way up on the trail, so it's quite a treacherous trail coming in here. You know, we only brought the car down so far. Excuse me, so we just left it and hiked down the rest of the way. So, with all this rain coming down, I'm getting wetter by the second. So, until the next one, Anthony says see you later. And I'm going to say the same thing. We'll catch you guys on the next one.